All right, hello everyone. Good morning and welcome back to The Witcher. Uh Starting off pretty good pretty good morning this morning. Got my uh sneak energy, not sponsored. And uh I think what we're going to try and do today is we are going to go through the cave that leads into the actual main city of Visima. I think that's I think that's going to be where we start off our day today. So, I guess that'll kind of uh open up that whole area of the game to us. So, uh let's go ahead and get this shit started. I'm not hearing any of the uh Bargoths or whatever spawning in. I don't know if that's just a because I'm running thing. Or if it's a they're just not doing it thing. Frogs. Okay, so we have that body. Yeah, because there's something we're supposed to be doing in here besides... Ugh, that didn't sound good. Oh, shit! Oh! Oh, fuck! Oh, shit, I gotta get out of here. Okay. Well, that was not good. So, uh, we may not be ready for that. Okay, so let's go collect our... Let's go collect our reward from Michael, I believe is this. Nope, that's just a royal huntsman. Who is... Mikkel, Michael, what it? I don't remember who he... That's the guard at the gate, isn't it? I believe so. I believe that's the guard at the gate, and possibly... He's going to help us figure out how to get our asses into Visima. Oh, there we go. Yep. Uh, ex excuse you. What? Okay. Yeah. I forgot to turn my damn ceiling fan on. So I already know it's going to get hot in this damn room. I 
I always forget because I uh I, I don't I leave the light off while I'm recording. So all the all the light that's on me is my ring light that I use. Oh hey, what's going on here? Leave me be. I won't surrender my workshop for all the treasure in the world. Oh, you'll give it up, Gramps, or else. Or what? A witcher! Kill him! Not likely. Oh. You're ours, Witcher. You should have left Salamandra alone. This bridge will be your grave. I need Okay, so this is Salamandra. Okay. I gotta recover. Gotta recover. You're dead. All right, I should be able to get it like this. Ah. Uh -uh. Whoo! That was tough. Thank you, Witcher. You saved me. And my laboratory, my beakers, my treasures. Anytime. And for my payment. I know all too well what they're after. To use the stolen secrets, Salamandra needs equipment. Without it, the Witcher's mutagens are useless. They almost grabbed Kalkstein and his treasures. They almost succeeded at Kaer Morin. Makes a huge difference. Almost makes a huge difference. If I had stayed and fought the Frightener with Vesemir, I might have faced a different threat today. They were here for me. I made a choice some time back. Had you known this would happen, would you have chosen differently? Um. Yes. Yeah, I guess. Hindsight. If only I'd seen the consequences then. Put it behind you and carefully consider your choices. Think things through before you act. Nonetheless, I am grateful to you for the choice you made this time. Visit my shop in Vizima for any ingredients you need for your potions at a discount. Farewell. shouldn't have defended the old man. You come talking again. <laughs> what are you going on about? The old man comes here and talks and talks. It gives me headache. I'll stone him next time. I wouldn't if I were you. He's a powerful alchemist. Uh, Captain said, only admit those with passes. I know, I know. They're moving me to Millgate tomorrow. That's where I'll stand. If you have a pass, look for me there. Okay. Uh, I got rid of the ghouls in the crypt. A hundred thanks, Master. Here be a month's pay. Oh, the boys will be happy. 
They plan to search for treasure in the crypt. Take a pick to one of the walls. I found a young woman's body inside. The ghouls came for her. Young woman? No. It can't be. My Elsa, I, I, I loved her. I wouldn't know her name. It appears she poisoned herself. No, no, no! It was that vile witch! The devil's whore poisoned my Ilsa! No! I'm sorry for your loss, but I need to know about Salamandra. They have passes, they do. The only ones, leave me be. You have the evil eye, you bring bad tidings! Be gone! Don't forget to tell the Reverend I got rid of those ghouls. Farewell. Cool. So I need to start working on heading towards the Reverend. I'm sure I'm going to come across drowners here. Yep. What is that red dot that I keep seeing? Oh yeah, I'm getting a whole bunch of them now. Hmm. I'm not quite sure what they are. Are those supposed to be in game or is those some kind of weird artifacts that are happening? I don't know, I've never noticed them before. That's odd. Hmm. I honestly can't tell. <sighs> Fuck off. Oh, what the fuck is that? Munching on some dead bodies or something? Hell yeah. Ooh. I am down with that, my guy. Dead body that I cannot interact with. Oh, 
feel like there's something I'm supposed to be able to do. Huh. I don't even care to grab stuff off of them anymore. Hey, I'm I'm going to throw down a quick save. Maybe this is a place for later in the game? That's what I have to assume, right? Ooh. I don't know if y'all can hear that, but it is thundering and rumbling like hell right now. I would be worried, typically, but, uh, or, used to I would be worried, but everything in this room, basically, all computers, monitors, everything is all on a UPS, so I'm not really worried about anything happening. Like, if I lose power or anything like that. Since I'm on a UPS. If I lost... If, you know, the power got knocked out right now, I could probably still play for... I don't know, probably about two hours. I could probably still play. Oh, Abby! Really, girl? I must have hurt her feelings. She's gotten into this, like, real bad... She's gotten into this real bad habit of where she'll walk in I don't know if I don't know if it shows up on camera. But she likes to walk in and then she'll walk underneath my right arm and she'll just like scoop it and it'll 
depending on how I'm holding the mouse at the moment, sometimes I'll, like, pick up my whole mouse and, like, smack it on the desk. Or I'll, it'll, I'll, like, basically throw it. Because she actually, like, like, she gets her nose under. And she, like, actually, oh, that's, yeah, she actually, like, just, it's my arm. Fell through as soon as she went to do it, so I wasn't paying that much attention to the screen. But I think it was noticeable because I think I like done like a jerk motion. I don't think she's scared of the storm or anything. She. Out of my three dogs that are in the house, she's the one that's usually never bothered by storms. My male, he's the one that, like, he usually gets full on the shakes when the when it starts thundering and storming and stuff. But he's laying on the ground, kind of over there in front of that set of drawers over there. He's, he's laying on the ground right there, just, just chilled out. And then, Scout, my, you know, my female, the, the one that I have the picture of right there. She's not, she only gets scared of storms when they're, like, really bad. Like when that when the thunder hits and it is shaking the entire house. Anything less than that, and she normally don't care. Which she honestly doesn't care about a lot of things. She's unbothered 99% of the time. Yeah, the cavern beneath the city walls. Where is that? Yeah, that is that over there. Shit, so that's where I need to go. Damn it. I don't want to go there. Because those guys kicked my ass. Um, will swapping to Ignis help me? We are about to learn if Ignis will help any at all. Okay, okay, I'm getting a little bit more done. A little better, a little better. Am I gonna get one of these down? Okay, that gives me one down. It doesn't do much for me. Ow, shit. Fuck you. Fuck! Fuck! I don't know.
I don't know how I'm supposed to do anything about that. Like, I actually don't know. That feels like it's... That feels like it's something that I'm gonna have to have, like... I'm gonna have the... Gonna have to have, have mutagens or something for. It doesn't seem like something that I can just... Power through. There's too many of them, right? I mean, that's the whole... That's the whole deal. Is there's too many of them. Where might I get a pass? The Order of the Burning Rose has got passes. The Eternal Fire fights the plague. I've seen no knights here. Would the Reverend know anything? He knows a lot. Wouldn't hurt to ask. Farewell. Okay, that's like the main thing we're working on, right? Is... I'm doing all this stuff so the Reverend will give me a pass into the city, correct? Sorry, I, I feel like I've played, I've been playing this game for so damn long. But Steam says I only have like seven hours on this game. Uh, come on. Come on. You wanna play these fucking games? I'm with it. Let's play these motherfucking games. Come on. Come with it now, stinky. See, I have plenty of that crap. So yeah, it's actually pretty damn immersive that it's storming in the game, and it's also storming IRL for me right now. Like, that actually works out pretty good, because I can hear thundering in my headset, and I can feel feel the thundering in my feet. I just need to find a fireplace or something somewhere. Camp campfire. Oh, 
Is that one that spawned all the way up here? Oh yeah, there's multiples. That's wild. I don't think I've ever seen enemies that are spawned in from that far away in this game. See, like, I'm, I'm not even in their range. Yeah, see, like, he just spawned in. And we have, you know, see, they're spawning in now. My cat eye has also uh, went away now because I just rested for five hours. Now I need to go back. Now I gotta talk to the Reverend, because he should be up now. I'm gonna make the trip over there. Hopefully he gives me the pass so I can just go into the damn city. And I don't have to, like... Keep working on random fucking encounters to run into the salamandra. Run into the damn salamandras to maybe have a chance of getting a pass. I would really hope if I could just have one given to me by the Reverend, because I've been running around doing all of his damn chores for him. And then, in true Reverend fashion, he's gonna keep telling me I'm fucking evil. But then, once I make all the problems go away, it's gonna be, you know, Oh, thank God, praise the Lord, praise the Lord for making that evil go away. And it's like, no, motherfucker, I made the evil go away. Speak quickly. Praise me, you son of a bitch. Odo's and Heron's monsters are gone. For Mikkel, I cleared the crypt of ghouls. I must admit I'm impressed. You may yet defeat Salamandra. To do that, I need to know where to find them. I will say nothing until you eliminate the beast, Witcher. That is my condition. I've done all you asked. Where's the Salamandra hideout? Go to the inn, where a group of Salamandra's service has taken over. They hide in the old house. Olaf will have a key. And Witcher? Yes? Nothing. May the eternal fire shine on your soul. Tell the villagers to stay at home now. I think I he's setting me up. Hurt. Okay, back to the end there.
All right, I guess I will see y'all back at the end. Hmm. We're gonna have this now. No, leave me alone. Ooh, little dove. Cue us a different tune. <laughs> Keep your hands off me. She is feisty. Say, let's do what we did unto Mickle's girl, Ilsa. What a screamer. <clears throat> mm. You knew too. He likely told you to wait like us. Let's have our way with this little chicky. It so happens that this lady is with me. None of you will touch her. So you say. We aim to have our fun and you won't stop us. Is that so? I'll slay you like a dog! <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if these are if this is supposed to be if these are supposed to be this easy like I'll... Garrett, yeah. you arrived just in time are you all right i am now they surprised me all the peasants ran out and i was trapped they killed the innkeeper. That's the last time they hurt anyone. That was some swift sword work. As for me, I'm done delaying. I need to get to Vizima. I hope to see you there. Let me walk you to the gate. These roads can be dangerous. No, you need to deal with the salamanders. Don't worry about me. I'll wait for you here. Make them suffer, Geralt. For me. I'll come back for you, Shani. I'll be waiting. The innkeeper. I should check his pockets. All right. I don't know why would the innkeeper have a key to their hideout. That doesn't... Oh, okay. Thank you. That doesn't track. You know? Why does the innkeeper have a key to the bad guy's hideout? Unless it's just because it it's a random house and maybe, I don't know, the innkeeper is almost like the trusted person in the outskirts. Hmm. Okay, so I need to go to the map. Ah. Okay, 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 okay. I know where we're going now. The little cave that we just went to earlier. Right up here. Oh, yep, there they are, just hanging out outside. Oi! What are you doing here? Where's your tribute? What tribute? I mean the kids, fool. Let me pass. No tribute, no entry. This is pointless. <laughs> Die, shit eater! A tribute? My tribute is fucking you in your ass. How do you like that tribute? Yeah. How do you like 
back. Oh, get you some. Gonna be close. Okay. I'm just gonna hang out for a minute. Just kind of hang out here. While I recover some health. You took your time. You have something of mine. No longer, I'm afraid. And you, like your predecessor, you work for rapists and murderers. Enjoying it? Where's Berenger? That dolt ran off. But during our brief acquaintance, he was certainly more talkative than you. No wonder, given Azar Javid's persuasiveness. Did you say I work for murderers? That lice-ridden village hick Odo came to us for advice on how to kill a warrior. We said someone so pathetic could only fight soldiers in dreams. Who's Azar Javed? A powerful mage. You're no match for him. We'll see. Your courage isn't lacking, Witcherette. We'll see how you fare after Azar gets you. This is a scintillating conversation, but it's time for some action. 
We Ooh. don't have what you seek. It's not here. They took it straight to our base in Vizima. Too bad. Let's dance. All together! Oh. Die, bastard! <laughs> I need shit. Yeah, I really needed to uh, meditate and make some swallow and stuff. I think I'm just gonna have to run until I can, like, recover some. I don't think I'm regaining. That's the only bad part. I don't think I'm regaining any health. That's the only part that is sucking right now. Together, I'll kill you. Yeah, if I'm regaining health, it's very slowly. He wouldn't run. I was stuck in the animation. Okay, we're gonna drink our swallow. for me. I'll kill you. 
Okay. Woo! Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and save again. Okay, so now I'm gonna drop in. Try this shit again. You took you have no where's that no Did you say that we who's up will your this is we just it's too all together Ask him. I'll rip your gut open <laughs> I can just tear this fool up. Yeah. Ah, not a chance now, huh? That was some neat sword work. Alvin, why are you here? The Reverend set me to this deserted house. He said someone would be waiting there for me. That son of a... So it was a setup. <clears throat> I'm glad you're safe. It was a setup. The Reverend's in on it. To Vizima. That's where I need to go to find Salamandra. Follow me. We'll find a way out of this cave. That wall looks pretty thin. Maybe we can break it down. Let's try. Ooh, ho, ho, ho. Oh, hey, there's a torch. Yeah. Oh, it won't let me save. that Abigail why did you come here witcher why are you here witch I'm brewing up another spell why lots of smoke in your magic mighty ingredients make mighty spells mighty enough for the whole village why are you doing this the angry mob has come burn the witch they cry she has summoned the beast I must defend myself men summoned the beast with their wicked deeds I'm not surprised. Honest Mikkel violated Ilsa. She took her own life. You profited from the poison. Odo killed his brother for coin. The Reverend exiled his daughter when she became pregnant. Now she whores herself in Vizima. Heron sold a squirrel to the guards for gold. You knew, but did nothing. They trade their gold for poisons and other potions. No business of mine how they're used. It's clear why the beast haunts you. I need to expose the guilty. Stay here while I speak to those outside. Don't let them harm me. My sins are not as great as they say. Really? Learn for yourself if you like. We're alone. We have some time. Oh? Abigail. I was drawn to you from the start. Woo! I'm probably gonna have to blur that.
burn the devil's mistress. Let the bitch die in pain. The witch hides within. Let the eternal fire consume her sinful body, and we'll be rid of the beast. Not so fast. She must be judged fairly. That bitch ruined my life. She cast her spells on my brother, wanted to steal him and his gold. My brother scorned her, so she did the devil's magic on me, used me to kill him. The treachery. I came across a doll that resembled you in her hut. I dream of it even now, her magic committing the murder. She should die! Your Woo! brother was a warrior. You're nothing but a drunk. How could you have killed him unless he was sleeping? Why listen to him, Reverend? He's a mutant, a f freak, a, a witcher. What are your charges, Harren? She... She made me a hawker. She p p promised herself to me if I helped the Skoyatel. I detest non-humans, but I had to, to, to trade with them. You've done all right for yourself. G gold isn't everything. There are principles to abide by. Woo! We're just calling everybody out. Fuck yeah. Call them all out. Of what you say. Have you made your decision? What do you think, Reverend? The witch used Odo and Haran. She poisoned Ilsa. Mikkel raped Ilsa, who took her own life. Abigail should have departed long ago, but stayed to exact revenge for the evil fate that befell her. She used the devil's magic on these simple people and summoned the beast. What? Ooh. Ooh. This looks like a real fucking choice I need to make here. Is the Reverend wrong or is Abigail wrong? Shit, what choice do I make? No. Because what's his name is tra traded with the bandits for 100%. Odo, I don't know. I don't remember seeing the doll in Odo's likeness. And then uh, we just seen something about the Reverend working with them. Shut up, you bastard. You lead this band of rogues, so you must know they sell children to the salamanders. And you knew about the rape and murder. I spit on you. You're all the same. All guilty. You'll regret this. I'm getting Abigail. Return to your homes. Since the beginning of time, woman has been the nest of all evil. The tool of chaos. Party to the conspiracy against the world and the human race. Woman is ruled solely by corporal lust. To satisfy her insatiable hunger and unnatural desires, she gladly serves demons. They intend to kill us. Don't be afraid. There she is! Burn the foul witch! No one is burning anyone. Friends, they wish to scare us. Fear not! They're helpless as long as we stand together! Is that so? Be gone, Witcher, and leave the witch, or we'll burn you too. I'd like to see you try, Pleb. Pleb. Ah! Shove off, and maybe I'll let you be. You have two options. Wait until I leave and then murder Abigail, but then I'll come back. I'll slay every lice-ridden peasant, anything that moves and can't climb a tree. Or you can try to lead honorable lives, clear your conscience, start again like humans. The choice is yours. Thank you, Geralt. 
Let's go. We need to deal with the beast. about to run into the beast. That was bad. Where'd my swallow go? Okay, that's it right there, right? Shit. I just need to run while I... fucking gain. Helping that whore was your last mistake. Die! Bloody mutant! I've enough strength for the two of you. Odo, grab the pitchfork! Oh, so y'all are all gonna fucking go on me now. You motherfuckers. basically just killed everybody like then everybody in the entire outskirts to me without your aid. I'm glad you found it in yourself to believe me. I chose the lesser evil. I'm sorry you think so. Farewell. Oh shit. Was that not the right decision? Well, the beast, beast is dead now, so there shouldn't be any more of the bird... of the bird ghosts or whatever they're called spawning. Ooh. You 
just popped up out of nowhere, didn't you, you bastard? Quit jumping when I jump you. Some bitch. Geralt? Are you all right? I was so worried. I'm fine. I'll tell you what happened on the way to Vizima. I'm done with this village. So am I. I hope I never return. It's unfathomable how many criminals live here. These are hardly pleasant times, Geralt. The plague, impending wars. Still, I'm astounded. Do you know how the beast came to be? No. They unknowingly created it with their misdeeds. A powerful sorcerer couldn't have matched it. And all they needed was hatred, baseness, and greed. It sounds like a fairy tale. Every tale contains a grain of truth. Let's go. Vizima awaits. All right, then. I do, however. Yeah. Need to do this. Oh, did she just go without me? Okay, then. What happens if I go see Abigail now? I'll gather my belongings and leave this damnable town. Thanks again. I wonder what this man-shaped doll is for. I'll gather my belongings and leave this damnable town. Thanks again. Okay. Well, she doesn't sound pissed at me, I guess. Which I guess it doesn't matter. I don't think I'm going to see her again. Everyone's dead. Okay. Oh, there she is. She only went a little ways without me. Vizima lies beyond this gate. 
I hope we never return here. Me too. The beast is dead. The salamanders are dead. And the peasants. Hmm. I have a pass. Mikkel should let us enter. Let's go. Come on, Mikkel. Mikkel, I need to enter the city. I have a pass. I wanted to say I was sorry. I apologize, Witcher. Apologize to Ilsa, Mikkel. Ooh. Are we about to Sergeant, have a problem? That Witcher's here. The one I told you about. Who do we have here, Mikkel? Is this the man we want? Yes, sir, Sergeant, sir. It's that filthy freak, the Witcher. Yep, we're about Blasphemer to have a problem. Blasphemer and a counterfeiter, do I guess well? Yes, he asked who's allowed into the city. Then came with that, uh, that letter of safe conduct from the Order. Now, if that's a knight of the Order, then I'm Princess Ada. Son of a bitch. No hey, good. let me out of here. I'm innocent. Those five pounds of fist tech were for personal use. Hey, you, jailer, at least move me. I don't want to be with the politicals. Politics makes you rot. I'm a decent thief. Let me out. Shut your True. trap. I'm busy. Jethro, keep it down. You're looking to kill me? That thief's bugging me. Thief, right. And I'm here with the politicals. Scandalous. I said shut up! Stop screaming or on my mother's life I'll bloody smash your junky mouth. Absolutely beautiful. What's your problem, Whitey? You wanna dance to Vizeman? Come on, I wanna see your hands in the air. Oh boy. Jethro, open the cell. Ooh, scared. Soft as butter. Come on, Whitey. What you got? Back off. What? You want to fight or not? Professor, move it. You're free. How ironic. Our paths cross again. So near and yet so far. Fear not, Witcher. We'll meet again, I assure you. You're making a mistake. This man's a murderer. You fail to grasp the basic rules governing this world. You're a genetically modified murderer with no place in modern society. But we'll tend to that problem next time. Farewell. I can't wait. Oh boy. Okay. So everybody's prisoner except for Tomorrow's my Elven big Convict day. and Muscle Why Man. You here, elf? Delighting in the last moments of my life. Or trying to. I hang tomorrow. I have a request. Mm -hmm. I've always found games pleasant, and Jethro let me keep my dice. If you don't have your own set, we can share mine. Oh, yeah. I got nothing. Oh, he's got three of a kind. Let's try it.
Boom! Three of a kind sixes. Yeah. Hell yeah. Nothing again. He's got a... Oh, I got a... I had a pair too. Okay, I didn't see that. His pair's... Oh no, it's the same. We're both got a pair of ones. Fuck it, let's go up. Roll it, baby. Nothing. Oh no, yeah, I get, that gave me three of a kind. I got a pair of sixes. Oh, sweet, but it still goes to me. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Alright, you maggots. The king in his mercy will pardon whoever subdues the cockatrice in the sewers. Pardon? What about half the kingdom, the princess's hand in marriage? Clever. Watch what you say, Witcher. Political jokes could get you in trouble. I'll slay the monster. Too late. There's another volunteer. I'm the better candidate. <sighs> the creep in the corner claims he'll defeat it bare-fisted. Which creep? You who? That tub of lard? You're kidding. You want freedom? Fight for it. Whoever wins faces the cockatrice. Piece of cake. <laughs> I'll defeat you, then thrash that lizard and go free. Let's do it. <laughs> Time to die! <laughs> Pretty fast. Wow. You bastard. Bastard. You couldn't have beaten me without your spells. I didn't I use any. Life. The cockatrice is no joke. Next time, you'll get beaten. Oh, boy. <sighs> Congratulations. You won the right to slay the beast. I'm almost proud. Want to slay the beast? Or would you rather just stand there? I need a weapon. That's funny. We recently confiscated a witcher's sword. Where? Not your business. Jethro, bring that silver sword. The one we found at Tyler's? Yes, idiot. That one. Can I have it? Get it from Jethro. The rest of your gear is in deposit for afterwards. Fine. One more thing. I'll pay extra for the monster's head. Provided it's undamaged. I'll see what I can do. Okay. Oh, the sword. Where was it? Hurry up. I don't have all day. Yes. We also confiscated a potion. Once you've completed your task, collect your belongings from behind the bars. I'll ask about it. Then I'll get the professor. Stupid. Ooh. The professor just does the wet work. If you want to be effective, you'd strike at his boss. Though I doubt you'd succeed. He's a big player. He has concessions. Connections, you mean. I'll find him. First, you gotta survive your meeting with a cockatrice. Watch my belongings. I'll be back, and I'll want everything returned. <laughs>
I'm assuming that that was a drowner. Oh, Siegfried. I don't know who you oh, are, but... Oh, Burning Rose. Indeed. White hair, vertical pupils, signs of mutation. Skip the medical exam. Forgive me. I meant no harm. I'm Siegfried, a knight of the Order of the Flaming Rose. <sighs> I'm Geralt. I've heard much praise concerning the combat skills of witches. If you don't mind, I have some work to do down here, and I'd like to get it done fast. A cockatrice, correct? That's why I'm here. Let's talk. Yes? What do you know about cockatrices? Cockatrices, also known as scoffins, are a kind of ornithosaur. They're twice the size of a large bird. The link between reptiles and birds. They resemble roosters, hence their common name. Go on. The cockatrice is frequently mistaken for a basilisk, but they're two separate species. Contrary to common belief, the cockatrice's gaze does not turn people to stone, but one should be aware of its beak. The monster's beak is apt to tear its opponent's vital organs out with surgical precision. Often, the victim is slain immediately, especially when taken from behind. So how would you say the beast can be killed? You'll need to excel at swordsmanship. Without a silver sword, it'll be more difficult. A cockatrice likes to sneak up from behind and attack. Anything useful to be taken from the carcass? Its eyes are quite a versatile component, and precious. Its tail feathers are even more valuable. Impressive knowledge. I confess my knowledge of monsters ends with the cockatrice. My late father, Ike of Danel, may he rest in peace, left me an engraving of the beast. There were many more engravings, but they were lost inside a manticore's stomach. Only the cockatrice's image survived. My sympathies. Did you hunt the manticore too? No, I wasn't at home at the time. When I returned, I discovered my father, despite his infirmity, had decided to fight the manticore. He asked to be tied to a horse, and with a prayer, he charged the beast. As you can surmise, he met a tragic end. When I reached the site of their struggle, the monster was in horrible pain, seconds from dying. When it could not dislodge my father from his armor, it nearly swallowed the old man whole. Later, they would say the sacred fire in Ike's soul burnt the monster's heart. A heroic death. May he rest in peace. Think you can kill the cockatrice? The sacred flame will guide me. What prompted you to enter the sewers after a beast? It threatens Vizima. The Order's been fighting beasts for a while, rather effectively, too. Wait, that's witcher's work. You witchers are relics and few in number. You're no competition. The Order demands no payment for protecting humans. I suppose fairies funded your armor and castles. I've no desire to argue. We're both here. There's no reason to await the other's turn, especially while there are drowners here, too. Let's join forces instead. I long to see your combat skills, and I assure you, my sword is at your disposal. Agreed. Let's go. You lead. I know witchers are not supposed to. But... not okay I wasn't playing fast style damn it that's what was going on drowners you have to do fast style but I was picking it
Oh. Okay, I've taken enough of that. Get up, buddy. Get up, buddy. Okay, so I have to do... Oh! to the exit. Take the cockatrice's head. Vincent pays well for trophies. Very well, though it reeks. Is this where I came in? I guess so, right? That door leads out of the sewers. So, this is where we part. But... Quiet. I hear footsteps. Odd. Few would dare venture here. Oh. Killing the night too. Flaming holes! Oh. What the hell? Telling me that we just put down a cockatrice and you got knocked down almost immediately. Come on. Friends of yours? You could say so. The thugs with the salamander sign have been bothering me for a while. Who knew you'd be in the sewers? The captain of the guard. The loon from the jail and the prisoners. I fought the cockatrice for my freedom. Hmm. A limited number of suspects. You'll likely solve the mystery when you find the leader of those bandits. I have a friend in Vizima. A detective. See him for help. Where are you headed? I have things to attend to at my quarters. Then I'll venture out in search of beasts, as the world is still filled with them. You did well, Siegfried. Glad we met. I need to recover my things. Make sure you get everything. Jethro is known to have sticky fingers. Let's get out of here. Here's the key for the passage to town. A few days ago, I locked the door to keep the cockatrice in. Thanks. I'd rather not go back the way I came. We might meet again if ever you visit the sewers. At times, I venture down here in search of monsters. Ah, your sacred mission of protecting humankind? 
Your sarcasm is unnecessary. We're on the same side, Witcher. You'll realize this one day. Farewell, and thanks. If you ever need me, I'll be at my quarters in Vizima. Uh... Cool. You know what? I'm gonna have a celebratory beer. Hell yeah. Okay. I gotta get all the way back over here. Damn. Hmm. Interesting. The private eye Siegfried mentioned could be helpful. Have to start somewhere. You bring trouble. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go back there first. You're free, but you still need to observe the quarantine. Meaning? Don't leave the temple quarter. You must be kidding. We keep a close eye on you, Witchers. Didn't I hear you say that everyone's equal? What is it, Witcher? I can prove I killed the cockatrice. Impressive. That's 400 Oren's reward. Well deserved. Okay, 400 Oren, that's a good deal. How's the Salamandra investigation going? Patience, Witcher. All will be explained tonight. Any way oh. I can help? Stay clear of the warehouses and the slums. It's a sensitive case that doesn't require your sword. Just yet. The warehouses? You don't intend to go there alone? It's a secret operation. How do you expect me to go? With an assault team and full plate armor and a bugler? Relax. I'm no rookie, and I got a few things up my sleeve. No doubt. Meaning? <laughs> no matter. Have a good time today. Enjoy your freedom. And maybe tomorrow I'll serve you Javid's balls on a platter. Do you handle monsters too? I'd rather not waste my men Just go ahead and that. go through all of this. I'd pay anyone who kills a monster. Just bring proof. What pays best? Right now, my budget includes reward money for the cockatrice in the sewers and for some bloodthirsty plant that kills people in the swamp. Okay, now to talk to Jethro. You killed the cockatrice. On behalf of King Faltest, I grant you an official pardon. Finally, this absurdity is over. Take your belongings from the trunk before I sell them. And remember the reward on the cockatrice's head. Vincent gets oh, very excited about trophies. Ah, I can finally relax. I'll inspect what we've confiscated here. Hmm, good quality gear.
I, oh, okay. That's the trunk. Let's see, where the fuck is the trunk? Alright. Hell yeah. Oh? <laughs> Damn, it's strong. What's strong? None of your business. I just... <laughs> I have questions. Ask. A parcel's missing from my belongings. We're glad you're not doing extra time for it. We've confiscated it. Don't mention it to the captain. Damned thieves. <laughs> Got a cold? I want my fucking package. <laughs> you're pretty green. Not so green I don't know the best way to take Fistek. Fold back your skin and rub. Where? Where you can fold back your skin, Jethro. <laughs> if you buy Fiztech from Coleman at the Hairy Bear, don't say I sent you. I have questions. Ask. If Foltest put a reward on the professor's head, he must detest Salamandra. It's not royal gold. Privately funded. Interesting. Mm. There's also payments for Salamander badges taken from dead bandits. Who is this philanthropist? I can't tell you. But the sponsor's representative spends his evenings at the tavern. I'll check it out. <laughs> mm. Did that maybe grease them up a little? Okay, I guess not. See ya. Damn it. Okay. So do talk to Coleman now. Vincent, city guard, city guard. Is it, Witcher? Okay. See you. Hmm. So where is Vincent? I mean, not Vincent. Uh, Coleman. Oh. Okay, that's gonna have to be where I go ahead and stop. I've been going two hours now. I need to get up, move around for a little while. So, uh, thank you everyone for tuning in. We got a lot accomplished today, I think. I mean, we finished up chapter one. Got into Visma where we've start now started chapter two. And uh, now we have a whole new place to explore and a lot of a lot of things to take care of. So thank you everyone for watching and I will see y'all in the next video.